Assalamu alaikum. A very good day to all. How are you today? I hope you are doing great. Let's continue with our English language lesson as usual. Let's recite the dua. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Oh Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, is our learning, bless our knowledge, may the success be in our life. Amen. So today's skills are listening and speaking. The objectives are at the end of the lesson, you should be able to 1. Listen to the conversation and fill in at least 3 information correctly. 2. Give correct directions to get to at least one place. Now, I want you to open your textbook, turn to page 124, unit 13, Overcoming the Odds. Activity 1, we are looking at this listening activity. But before that, I want you to get ready with your writing book because I want you to copy down this in your writing book. Now, let's listen. I'm going to read the conversation for you. You need to pay attention to the important details. The Center of Excellence for the Paralympic Games Malaysia in Kampung Pandan, Kuala Lumpur, is a center for national Paralympic athletes. The objective of this center is to train disabled national and state athletes to achieve excellence in sports internationally. Among the sports facilities provided at the center are a swimming pool, an archery range, a basketball court, a multi-purpose court, goalball, and badminton courts. In addition, the center has an administrative block, a hostel which can accommodate 300 athletes and an underground car park. The center is also open to the public, special education school children and amateur Paralympic athletes. Do you know, goalball is played by blind athletes a team rolls the ball into the goal post while the opposing team blocks the ball with their body. Your task, listen again and fill in the information. Send the picture of your completed work to me. I'm going to give you the clues. One, two, three, four. You may refer to these clues. Next, activity two, turn to page 125. We are looking at this map. Let's read first. Excuse me, can you give me directions to the swimming pool, please? From here, go straight on until you come to a roundabout. At the roundabout, Take the third turning into Jalan Ria. Go along the road until you see a basketball court on your right. The swimming pool is next to the basketball court. So today we are going to explore about asking for and giving directions. Do you know how to ask for directions? Let's learn. Asking for directions. There are many ways to ask for directions. For example, you can say, Excuse me, where is the shopping centre? 
Excuse me, how do I get to the park? Where is the zoo located? How do I get to the bakery? What's the way to the museum? Excuse me, is there a cinema near here? Next, giving directions. Go straight, turn left, turn right, go past. This is the picture of a roundabout. Let's say you are here. So this is your first left or first turning, second turning, third turning. Next, location. Next to, the houses are located next to each other. On the left, on the right, between, opposite. Let's explore more directions vocabulary by looking at this circle map. Roundabout, zebra crossing. Corner, traffic lights, street, highway, intersection, signpost, T junction. More, boulevard, country road, sidewalk, tunnel, walkway, avenue, lane. Alley, bridge. Next, let's recap by looking at this circle map of places. Home, school, zoo, toy shop, restaurant, circus, theatre, bookshop, museum, cinema, park, amusement park. Shopping centre. Now let's practice. Based on this map, give directions to your friend to get from 1. The field to the girls hostel. 2. The basketball court to the cafeteria. So let's try. The first one, the field to the girls hostel. This is the field. From the field, go straight on until you come to a roundabout. At the roundabout, take the first turning. Go along the road until you see the boys' hostel on your left. The girls' hostel is opposite the boys' hostel. Next, the basketball court to the cafeteria. Can you see where's the basketball court? This is the basketball court. From the basketball court, go straight on until you come to a roundabout. At the roundabout, take the second turning. Go along the road until you see the cafeteria. Now your task, record yourself giving directions. You may refer to this and this. Send the recording to me. All the best. This is your enrichment activity. This is optional. You can do this activity. If you are done with the main task, click the link. Don't forget to check the description column of this video for the link. Click the word. Click the picture. When you're done with all, click finish. You may click show answers or try again too. All the best. Have a nice day and bye.